Hi everyone, Kate here with the final Edwardian Christmas dinner recipe video. Today we'll be making a fun but simple dessert, Christmas ice cream pots. This idea comes from a 1912 issue of the Ladies Home Journal. For this recipe, you will need some ice cream, a chocolate or other brown tone flavor is recommended, chocolate, a cherry or a nut or a raisin. I have some maraschino cherries left over from my witch apple video, so I'll be using those, as well as some little flower pots. The original recipe used little terracotta flower pots for this but I just used some cute containers I had on hand that looked appropriate. If using a real flower pot, I recommend lining it with foil or cling wrap to create a barrier, as some glazes and finishes may not be suitable for food use. And lastly, we'll also need a little sprig of pine or evergreen. I picked this little bit of pine out of my front garden, you want to make sure that you don't use any poisonous greenery or a plant that has been treated with pesticides or herbicides. Most unsprayed pine trees should be fine. At the bottom of the cup, place a cherry or a nut or a raisin. Originally, this was intended to fill the hole at the bottom of the flower pot and stop the dessert from leaking out, but I just think it makes for a fun surprise at the bottom. Next, scoop on a layer of ice cream. Then top the dessert with finely grated chocolate. This is meant to look like dirt. <laughs> Finally, plant your evergreen in the top of the ice cream. My pine was a bit resiny, so I used some tin foil around the base so that I didn't get sap in my ice cream. And now you should have what looks like a mini pine tree. Now the pine isn't actually meant to be eaten, it's just a fun and festive decoration to elevate a dish of ice cream beyond the everyday. The original article suggested decorating the tree, so I used some mini Christmas ornaments to give it the full Charlie Brown treatment. Just be sure to work quickly or the ice cream will start to melt. Isn't that just adorable? As cute as it is, don't forget to remove the tree before consuming. I gave mine a rinse and just put it in some water to enjoy as a decoration. Well, that's it for this week. As always, thank you for watching, and I will see you in January. Bye! This video is made possible through the generous support of my Patreon members. Thank you.